What's up guys, I have another knife for you today. It is of the Monterey Bay Knives Ray Laconico designed slash owned and Chinese, unknown Chinese maker, um, EZC. So that's the name of the knife. That's the Monterey Bay Knives name. And the other uh, Monterey Bay knife that I reviewed on the channel was the um, Min Pin. So this is the e e D ECZ. And um, I like this one better. Um, it kind of reminds me of a smaller version of the Keen. And um, without the curved handle, just a straight handle. And also the... Um, Kaiser Yorkie that 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 he's gonna come out with, but this has a bigger this has a handle where you can get all four fingers on. Um, unlike the min pin, kind of was wasn't really working that good for me. And the thing that this uh, knife solves is it has the lock bar insert with the over travel stop, so disengaging the lock is not an issue. And this is a very thin blade and a light a light knife I'm going to um, put the stats up uh, on the left hand side right now so feel free to pause and check it out um, this is a titanium handle steel hardware titanium backspacer um, with a blade drop point blade that has a very nice stone wash and it is S35 VN, but there's no marking of that on the blade, only Ray Laconico's name and the Monterey Bay um, symbol. So, let me show you what the uh, pocket clip looks like. And this is very, I do like this pocket clip. It does a great job. Um, it's very symmetrical. It's got, you know, very symmetrical and it works very good. So. I like, I definitely, um, I'm a bigger fan of this knife. Um, the titanium has kind of like a slick feel. It's not like a, it's not like a blasted feel like, like this kind of titanium. So just, um, it is a little bit slick. This is almost like an office carry EDC type of knife. Um, it is pretty thin behind the edge does pretty good at cutting um, you almost want to have a choil up here but ergos are good because it's nice nice and just regular just straight so that that ended up working uh, pretty good for ergonomics there's no jimping on the blade flipper tab is pretty good you can do a light switch that's pretty much it a light switch you can't really push button on well, you can kind of, but one of the things I would have liked to see a better cutout to disengage that's kind of small to try to get your thumb into. So that's the only real negative I have. It is a little bit off-centered. I can probably me mess with that and fix it, but it has no lock. I mean, it has no um, movement, so I don't really want to mess with it. But, uh, pretty cool knife if you're looking for a Ray Laconico design and you missed out on the, the Mass Drop Keen, you wanted something a little smaller and lighter, this might be the one for you. Something just noticing now, um, I would actually kind of like a little bit of jimping on here because with everything being so smooth and slick, it's a little bit harder to to get real positive action on on the flipper tab so that's one thing I wish wish it would have had but that's all I got pretty pretty I like this one better um, than the min pin uh, so if you're interested go check them out I'll leave the website in my description box take care